Hey, welcome students to my channel Global English with Tanvi. Let's take a look at what we are going to do today. So, today we are going to know how to start speaking English. Speaking English is actually an art. You need to be good at it. But there are many who refrain from speaking in English. Specifically at public places, there are many who make mistakes. Still, they go on, and there are many others like you and probably me when I was years back who think and try to speak, make few mistakes, correct them, and then go on. So we are going to start this journey of speaking English. Yes, when I say speaking English, that means we are going to. Start speaking in English, but that will not happen in one minute or a day or a month. This is a process which is gradual. You cannot learn, and in fact, nobody can learn English just by thinking of learning it. So let's take a look how and why we have to start doing this. So. English. Why English? It's a foreign language, and there's not just one. There are so many foreign languages. So out of these different foreign languages that exist, as you can see on the screen, there's so many ways to say hello. But whenever you take a call, you only say hello. You don't say bonjour or hola or siya or hello. Why? That's because this is one language which is accepted by most of the countries around the world. Let's take a look at the next slide. So, if you see, why do we need to speak English? As I said, there's so many foreign languages. Then, why can't you learn the other languages and only English? People around the globe they are focusing on. Telling you that you need to speak in English, you need to learn these words, you need to improve your vocabulary, you need to improve your sentence formation. Why is that? Let's take a look at that. So, if I say this is a language spoken by over seventy percent population, not in India, but around the world, around the world. This language is spoken by over seventy percent population, and the reason behind this is not just one. There are many reasons, but we will talk about that later, some other day. The main thing for us to know is that it is one language which is spoken by not just us, not just you, not just the people around us. It is being spoken by several people. On this globe, and how can it help you? It can give more opportunities in the future. So this is not just one thing. If you learn how to speak it correctly, by correctly, I don't say that you have to use several flowering words. You have to use vocabulary terms which are difficult for common people to apprehend. You have to use language. You have to use vocabulary. Which is in a normal human being range. As you see, it's coming in the newspaper, but it is edited. So you don't have to speak the language that you see elsewhere. Your language has to be easy and it has to be understandable by the other person. That would happen. When would that happen? It can happen only if the other person and you both are aware of certain vocabulary terms. If you are not aware of those vocabulary terms, you cannot speak. So, in this process, you just have to remember one thing. Remember, English is an extremely easy language. Many people come to me and tell me. We have been speaking Hindi or our regional language for years gone by. 
and we speak in it well the other people understand it well why do we have to speak in english so my answer to each and one of those and to you would be that english as i mentioned in both the points above that it is being spoken by many people around the world it is highly in demand that you know a language which most of the people on the earth are using and it is one language which definitely will provide you several opportunities so learning this language is not difficult it is very easy you can learn it just by listening to it yes listening to it how many of you listen to english in a day 5 minutes 10 minutes or no you don't have any exposure to english as of now you will have to make that that's what you have to do today you have to listen to english being spoken by any native speaker native means people who are of our origin you have to listen to one of such speakers and then you have to use the vocabulary they have used in sentences of your own yes that's how you will word so that's how you are going to build your vocabulary so if you go on learning about different set of words you can build vocabulary you can improve your language skills and at the same time use them in sentences of your own i will share another video of mine talking about few vocabulary terms that we can use and how we can